Hey, minions. So there's this song about this little dude named Zacchaeus. He's kind of this weird Christian enigma. He's totally this peripheral character with his very own Sunday school song. So his song basically goes something like this. Zacchaeus was short. He climbed a tree to see Jesus. Jesus told him to come down. Jesus invited himself over to Zacchaeus' house. Zacchaeus was happy. The end. Now Zacchaeus gets like one chapter in one gospel, but even that tells us way more about the little guy than his Sunday school song. In fact, a little extra research on the interwebs gives us lots and lots of stuff Christians say about Zacchaeus. They can't stop talking about him. So again, I figure... If you're going to have the little kitty singing a Sunday school song about something in the Bible, why not just tell the kitties the whole story? One, two, three, here we go. Zacchaeus was a tiny little man and a tax collector was he. He had a position of importance with wealth and prosperity. Most Jews who worked for the Romans were corrupt beyond belief. Jew tax collectors were labeled traitors by the Jewish community. One ordinary day in Jericho, he climbed a sycamore tree. Zacchaeus, he was curious, and Jesus, he wanted to see. When Jesus saw Zacchaeus in a tree, said, Zacchaeus, come on down. You're a son of Abraham, and I'm going to your house today. The crowd was angry with Jesus for going to Zacchaeus' place. Why would the Savior sully himself? The whole thing was a big disgrace. But Zacchaeus was a happy man. He had seen the Lord that day. He repented all his acts of corruption, gave half of his wealth away. For a guy who gets one mention in the Bible, people sure have a lot to say. About a tiny little man in a tree who was never mentioned again. In Matthew, Mark, Luke, or John. Clement of Alexandria said Zacchaeus got a different name. He was later named Matthias, and old Judas he replaced. The story of Zacchaeus is used to illustrate your metaphor colluding heaven if you give earthly treasures away. A divine call to humility. Hey little dude, get out of that tree.